Residents of coastal areas prone to flooding such as Kilifi and Tana River counties are staring at a major flood disaster after reports indicated that water levels were high in River Sabaki and River Tana, which could break their banks any time. The Kenya Red Cross Society says it has dispatched teams to the ground for assessment and at the same time sensitized people to move to safer grounds. Kwafkia jana, hata leo, mto wa sabaki umeanza, ku, umeanza karibia kufunja kingo zake, hauja vunja, lakini unakaribia kufunja kingo zake, mto wa tana, umeanza kufunja kingo zake, mashamba ya tana river kwa saivi, baadhi ya mashamba ya sehemu za gulbante zimeanza ku, ku, kuathirika kwa saivi. Na upande wa tana, kilifi pia, upande wa bate, kwa sasa hivi maji ya tunatarajia kwamba wakati huo wote kuanzia sasa yatakuwa yameingia katika miji ambayo inaishi watu. Kilifi Governor Mason King has issued an alert and directed people living along the river banks to move to higher grounds to avoid loss of lives and property. Pata ujumbe kwamba uh, mafuriko yameanza katika sehemu ya miinuko ya Kenya na kawaida uh, mafuriko yakeanza katika sehemu ile bila shaka. Uh, tunajua wazi kwamba mto sabaki lazima utafurika na wakati mwingi unaleta uharibifu mkubwa na kwa sababu tumepata habari hizi mapema uh, tayari ujumbe tumepeleka kule mashinani sehemu ya sabaki kwamba watu wote ambao wanaishi katika sehemu ya tambarare ya mto sabaki waondoke na waende katika sehemu za miinuko Kingi while speaking in Malindi during the launch of relief food distribution to Malindi and Magarin residents said people should not wait until floods begin sweeping their homes to move. Peter Ward administrator upande ule wazee wa vijiji, sub chiefs na chiefs wao wako katika mstari wa mbele kuona kwamba hakuna mtu hata mmoja anabaki na kuja kusombwa na wale maji ya Afrika. Dan Kaburu K24 Newsgate